Hello, welcome to Lisa Marvin Art. It's resin day. I had so many pieces to resin. This is only half of it, but let's get to it. I wipe my pieces down with alcohol, safety first, and I take my Artworks resin, only in Canada, and I measure it precisely half and half one to one look at how thick and goopy that resin is so you're mixing resin into your hardener and yep yeah, perfect amount and see how it kind of like gloopy it is so you want to mix it around for about three minutes this resin is really good with bubbles but if you have a hard resin you can warm it up and get those bubbles out it's pretty clear so this is the way i do it everyone does it differently but this is easier for me when i do a lot of big pieces i pour out a big dollop over each piece just so i know um, if i need to mix more resin or if i'm going to be able to cover all my pieces Pieces. Then I use my hand to wipe the resin. Obviously right now I'm only doing one hand, so it looks funny. There are many other tools you can use, but again, for me, for bigger pieces, using my hand and feeling where there's missing resin is easier. Then you take your torch and you get those bubbles out. And here is the dried final result. Look at all those sparkles. All these pieces are available except for some of them are already taken, but this one actually doesn't have sparkle. I think this was all Amsterdam paint that I did. And I love how, oh, that's my little rose. I love how the resin makes um, my TLP piggies, this little piggy pigments pop. This one already sold, but look at that violet that's coming through. I love it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, there's so many different kinds of pieces. All of these, oh, look at my little, this was kind of an oopsie, but it's like an alien bloom. Um, all of these pieces were done on my YouTube if you want to see how I made them. And um, I'm going to be listing them on my Instagram page in my highlights. So if you're interested, go over and take a look. And if not, just enjoy the sparkle. Um, super fun. This was part of my Angel Bloom series where I kind of created a halo. Love that. And I just wanted to show you this is the new chameleon pigments, the stuck up pigs. And it's kind of hard to show the shift in this light, but that's a super shifter that goes from green to blue. It's so pretty. Anyways, enjoy the rest of the sparkles. If you have any questions, let me know. And if you're ever scared of starting resin, just jump right in, do it. It's not as hard as you think it is and it's so worth it for the sparkle alone. Have a good day, bye.